Welcome to our latest video, where we'll take you on a journey through the biggest space discoveries of the last decade. We'll delve into the mysteries of the universe and uncover some of the most groundbreaking discoveries over the past 10 years. From black holes to exoplanets, we've got it all covered in this video. So hit the subscribe button, like this video, and leave a comment below about your favorite space discovery. Let's get started. The fourth discovery will shock you the most. Star Topic – A Giant Hole in the Universe our first topic takes us to the depths of space, where scientists have discovered an enormous area known as the Boötes Void. At almost 330 million light years across, this vast region is nearly completely devoid of matter. This supervoid, also called the Great Nothing, is considered one of the largest structures in the universe. Its existence raises some intriguing questions about the nature of the cosmos. The discovery of this void challenges the current understanding of how the universe is structured and raises questions about the forces that shape it. What is the giant hole in the universe? The giant hole in the universe, also known as the Eridanus Void, is a massive region of space that is empty of any visible matter, including galaxies, stars, and dark matter. It is located in the Eridanus constellation and spans nearly 1 billion light years. How was the giant hole in the universe discovered? The void was discovered by a team of astronomers from the University of Wisconsin Madison using data from the Dark Energy Survey. This project aims to studying the accelerating expansion of the universe. The researchers identified the void by analyzing the distribution of galaxies in the survey, noting the absence of galaxies in a particular region. What does the discovery of the giant hole in the universe mean? The discovery of the void challenges the current understanding of the universe's structure, which is based on the theory of cosmic inflation, which predicts that the universe should be more homogeneous and isotropic on a large scale. The void's existence suggests that other forces, such as cosmic voids, may play a more significant role in shaping the universe's structure than previously thought. What are cosmic voids? Cosmic voids are vast regions of space that are largely devoid of matter, including galaxies, stars, and dark matter. They are the opposite of galaxy clusters and are thought to result from the universe's expansion, which causes matter to spread out. How do cosmic voids form? Cosmic voids are thought to form when the universe's expanding forces push matter outwards causing matter to accumulate in denser regions such as galaxy clusters and leaving behind large, empty spaces. What is the impact of discovering the giant hole in the universe? The discovery of the giant hole in the universe has significant implications for our understanding of the universe's structure and evolution. It suggests that the cosmic voids may be more important in shaping the universe's structure than previously thought and could provide new insights into the nature of dark matter and dark energy. What are the challenges of studying cosmic voids? Studying cosmic voids is challenging because they are largely empty and do not contain any galaxies or stars, which makes them difficult to observe directly. However, scientists can indirectly study cosmic voids by analyzing galaxies' distribution around them. What are the potential benefits of studying cosmic voids? Studying cosmic voids could provide new insights into the nature of dark matter and dark energy, which are thought to make up most of the universe's mass and energy, but have yet to be directly observed. Understanding the role of cosmic voids in the universe's structure could also help us better understand the universe's evolution over time. What are the next steps in studying the giant hole in the universe? The discovery of the giant hole in the universe has opened up new avenues for research. Scientists will likely focus on understanding the nature of cosmic voids and their role in shaping the universe's structure. They may also use new instruments and technologies 
To study the Eratinus void and other cosmic voids in more detail, check out the links in the description to learn more about this fascinating phenomenon. Other Space Discoveries Number 1. Water on the Moon In 2009, NASA's Lunar Crater Observation and Sensing Satellite, La Crosse Mission, discovered evidence of water on the Moon. The mission involved crashing a rocket into a shallow crater near the Moon's south pole, causing a plume of material to rise. The plume was analyzed by instruments aboard a spacecraft trailing behind the rocket, and water molecules were detected in the plume's spectral signature. This discovery was significant because it suggested that water, a critical human exploration resource, could be harvested on the Moon. Since then, several additional studies have confirmed the presence of water in various forms on the Moon, including in permanently shallowed regions at the poles. Number 2. Kepler 452b Kepler 452b is an exoplanet discovered in 2015 by NASA's Kepler spacecraft. The planet is located approximately 1400 light years away from the constellation Cygnus and is estimated to be about 1.6 times the size of Earth. It orbits a star similar to our Sun but is about 1.5 billion years older. The discovery of Kepler 452b was significant because it was the first exoplanet discovered that was Earth-sized and located in the habitable zone of its star, where liquid water could exist on the planet's surface. This made it a promising candidate for hosting life. Since its discovery, scientists have continued to study Kepler 455b and its star system to learn more about the planet's atmosphere, composition, and potential habitability. Number 3. Proxima b Proxima b is a potentially habitable exoplanet that orbits the star Proxima Centauri, the closest star to our solar system. It was discovered in 2016 using data from the radial velocity method, which detects the wobbly motion of a star caused by the gravitational pull of an orbiting planet. Proxima b has a mass similar to that of Earth and orbits within its star's habitable zone, meaning that it could have liquid water on its surface. However, its atmosphere and potential habitability are still unknown. Number 4. TRAPPIST-1 TRAPPIST-1 is a system of seven Earth-sized exoplanets orbiting a cool red dwarf star about 40 light-years away from us. This system was first discovered in 2016 by the TRAPPIST Transiting Planets and Planetismal Small Telescope telescope located in Chile. TRAPPIST-1 was significant because it represented a large number of Earth-sized planets found around a single star. Three were located in the habitable zone, where conditions could be suitable for liquid water and life. Since its initial discovery, TRAPPIST-1 has been studied extensively by multiple telescopes and instruments, including NASA's Hubble Space Telescope and Spitzer Space Telescope. The observations have provided valuable information about the exoplanet's composition, atmosphere, and potential habitability. Number 5. Gravitational Waves In 2015, the Laser Inferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, LIGO, made history by detecting gravitational waves for the first time. Albert Einstein's theory of general relativity over 100 years ago predicted these ripples in the fabric of space-time but had only been directly observed then. The discovery was made possible by LIGO's two detectors, located in Louisiana and Washington State, which can detect incredibly tiny changes in the length of their arms caused by passing gravitational waves. The detection of gravitational waves opens up a whole new way of observing the universe, allowing us to study the most violent and energetic events in the cosmos, such as the collision of two black holes. This breakthrough has been called the start of a new era in astronomy. Number 6. New Horizons Mission Space launched the New Horizon mission in 2006 to explore the dwarf planet Pluto and its moons. On July 14, 2015, the spacecraft made its closest approach to Pluto, coming within 7,800 miles kilometers of its surface. The mission provided the first close-up images of Pluto and its moons, revealing stunning details about their geology and composition. One of the most surprising discoveries was the presence of mountains on Pluto, which scientists believe are made of water ice. The mission also found evidence of active geological processes on Pluto's surface, 
including nitrogen ice glaciers and cryovolcanoes. In addition to its exploration of Pluto, the New Horizons mission also provided valuable data on the Kuiper Belt, a region of the solar system beyond Neptune that contains thousands of small icy objects. The spacecraft flew by the Kuiper Belt object known as Arakoth on January 1, 2019, providing new insights into the formation and evolution of the early solar system. Number 7. Mars Curiosity Rover The Mars Curiosity Rover, also known as Mars Science Laboratory, was launched by NASA in November 2011 and landed on Mars in August 2012. Since then, it's been exploring the planet's surface, studying its geology and climate, and searching for signs of microbial life. One of the most exciting discoveries made by the rover was the detection of methane in the Martian atmosphere. Methane is a gas often produced by biological processes on Earth, leading to the speculation that it could be a sign of microbial life on Mars. In addition to the methane discovery, the Curiosity rover also found evidence of an ancient lake bed and stream channels on the Martian surface, indicating that liquid water may have existed on the planet. These findings have led scientists to believe that Mars was once a much wetter and more hospitable environment for life. Number 8. Saturn's Moon Enceladus Enceladus is a small icy moon orbiting Saturn that has been the subject of much scientific interest in recent years. In 2005, the Cassini spacecraft discovered evidence of geysers erupting from the moon's south pole, indicating the presence of a subsurface ocean of liquid water. This finding has sparked interest in the possibility of Enceladus harboring life. Further studies of the moon have revealed that the geysers are composed of water vapor, ice particles, and organic molecules. In 2018, researchers discovered complex macromolecular organic compounds in the plumes, indicating that Enceladus may have the necessary ingredients for life. The discovery of Enceladus and its potential for harboring life has opened up new avenues of exploration for astrobiology and planetary science. Further missions to Enceladus, such as the proposed Enceladus Life Finder mission, will seek to understand better the Moon's potential for hosting life. Number 9. Ultima Thule Ultima Thule is a Kuiper Belt object located 4 billion miles from Earth. The Hubble Space Telescope was first discovered in 2014. In 2019, it was visited by NASA's New Horizons spacecraft. Ultima Thule is of particular interest to scientists because it is believed to be one of the earliest objects in the solar system, having formed more than 4.6 billion years ago. During the New Horizons mission, the spacecraft captured high-resolution images of Ultima Thule, revealing that it is a contact binary composed of two separate objects that have become stuck together. This discovery has provided valuable insights into the formation of the early solar system. Number 10. James Webb Space Telescope the James Webb Space Telescope is an upcoming space observatory set to be the successor to the Hubble Space Telescope. It is designed to be a powerful tool for studying the universe, with the ability to observe visible and infrared wavelengths. One of the key goals of the James Webb Space Telescope is to study the first galaxies that formed in the universe and to look for signs of life on planets outside our solar system. The telescope is also designed to study exoplanets' atmospheres and search for signs of water and other molecules that could indicate life. The launch of the James Webb Space Telescope has been delayed several times, but it was currently scheduled for launch on October 31, 2021. It will be launched by an Ariane 5 rocket from the European spaceport in French Guiana. That's it for our journey through the biggest space discoveries of the last decade. We hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new about the universe. Remember to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and leave a comment below about your favorite space discovery. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.